We all face challenges in our life. These challenges can be some simple tasks like delivering a public speech or organizing an event. When we face these challenges, there are some obstacles that we have to overcome. When these obstacles surface, we can either shy away and miss our chance or we can face these challenges with a better understanding about these obstacles. These obstacles seem like the outside world plodding against us but actually these obstacles are within ourselves. Okay, okay. Now I am telling you like this obstacle and that obstacle. Actually, what are these obstacles that holds us from becoming successful? Let's find out. It is really, really important to have a good understanding about the challenges you face. Then only we can find the right tools to overcome them. Then one of the biggest obstacles that we have to face in our life is perfection. This is a common thing for most of us. When we have to do something in our life, we always used to think that it has to be perfect. But actually, this mindset about doing everything perfect keeps you away from becoming successful. Success comes with making mistakes. When you make a mistake, then you can learn from it. Learning will lead you to the success. Even for me, I have to deal with this perfect mentality. I think I have mentioned about this earlier. When I first started speaking and making videos like this, I thought this has to be perfect. This mindset wastes months before I actually start uploading. I thought that my look is not good enough to perform in public. I thought that my accent is not good enough. I thought that my editing skills are not good enough to make videos like this. Like this, I have lots of insecurities, but luckily with the help of my mentor, I was able to overcome these obstacles. Instead of trying to be perfect, start embracing your mistakes. If you go to the first 10 to 15 videos of my channel, those videos are horrible. The way I color grade them, the way I edit them, the way I speak in them, those videos are absolute disaster. But still I'm not deleting them or making them private because I love my mistakes. Those mistakes helps me to learn. That's where I came from. Still my videos are not perfect. Still the way I speak is not perfect. But I'm making progress. I'm becoming more confident in front of a camera. Like this, try to embrace your mistakes and try to learn from those mistakes. Like this, if you have any idea in your mind, don't wait until things become perfect. Just start it, have fun with the things and learn how to laugh at your mistakes. Then the second obstacle is fear. This feeling of fear comes with perfection. We are insecure about ourselves. We underestimate our skills and talents. This fear should come when we are not secure and safe. But most of the time, these threats are in our imaginary world. Sometimes we can't even find reasons for these fears. Again, if you go to the first few videos of my channel, in those days when I'm speaking, I always keep my hands in this way. I was not moving my hand. In those days, moving my hands was a really big deal. This is like my safe zone. Actually, I don't know. This safe zone, this idea, this fear was within my imaginary world. This fear of moving my hands holds me back from performing better. Like this, if you think deeply about your fears, then you will find that most of those fears are within your imaginary world, within your mind. However, now I was able to overcome these fears. Actually, I don't know how I overcame this. Probably I think with the experience, with the practice. This is like my 34th or 35th video. However, now I was able to overcome this. Like this, think about your fears deeply. It's time to overcome these fears. Then the third obstacle that holds you back from being success is lack of clarity. Imagine that you are going on a trip and now you need to pack. You can't pack everything you have to the suitcase. You have only limited space. You must have a clear idea about where are you going whether it is to the beach area or mountain area, how long it will take and what will you do. If you know these things, then it is easy to pack your suitcase. Our life is also like this. We don't have enough time and enough energy to do the everything in our life. We must have a clear idea about our goals and our dreams. Then it will be easy to make selections and carry out only the essentials to our future. Then the fourth obstacle is unclear boundaries. These boundaries can be anything that matters.
matters in your life. In early days, I was used to think about the everything that others told me about my life. I think about the things that my parents told me about my life and my future, what my relatives say, what my friends say. I always try to adjust my path according to their opinions, but the fun fact is most of the times I only got negative comments. At one point of my life, I was tired of thinking about all these opinions of others. Then I start making boundaries. I start focusing on me, myself, my goals and my dreams. Understanding this was like a turning point of my life. I became more stronger. I became more confident about my life. Don't misunderstand that making boundaries is not being selfish and don't think that if you make boundaries you will cut off from the everybody. It's just not letting others to take decisions about your life. Not letting others to influence you with the decisions that you take of your future. Life without clear boundaries is like being water. Try to hold the shape of the container without being the container. But success comes when you make your own container. Being successful needs overcoming lots of obstacles. There are a lot more obstacles out there, but in this video I mention only four obstacles. You know, we can't deal with everything at one time. Everything is about gradual approach. So try to understand these obstacles and try to overcome them. You will find your path to become successful in whatever thing you do. Hope this video will help you. Let's meet with another video. Have a wonderful weekend.